you go into camp, you got these big plans, you got some long range goals that you want to, you know, you want to look like or you want to get to, you want to attain. And then stuff happens every practice and you got to, you got to adjust, you got to pivot <laughs> and you got you got to readjust everything. So we're going through that right now, but that's camp everywhere. You know, it, you, you guys, you, you get people, people out here and there and everywhere. Every time I turn around, some guys got something that you have to adjust. So, um, you play with what you got and you get better with everybody that you can and you just keep going every day. I don't couldn't even tell you what day it is because it doesn't matter right now. You know, when you go into preseason camp, it's submarine time. And we'll come out and flip the hatch open here when school starts. That's about what we do. And I can feel the difference in the in the in this this game is starting on a Thursday night instead of a Saturday. So, you know, it's knocking, it's knocking on us early. We don't have time to have an even day or anything like that. We have to get better every day, so... It's always a push. The offensive line, I'm really happy with. Really happy with them. Jake, Jake went to tackle, so you know that's a transition from tight end. But he's doing really well there, and we need him to. And that was a, you know, that was a little bit of an ulcer all summer about thinking about how our tackles were going to be. Uh, we had Damon Mixon come in from Fort Scott. He originally was at SEMO, and uh, we got him to come here at sem at semester. And the tight ends, you know, we've got we've got some things to get done there. Um, you know, I'm, I'm hoping things work out for Charlie, but I'm not sure yet. We need him back. He looks real good. Um, Cam Carp's going doing good. Kenyante's doing good. We got a transfer from Western Illinois. He's doing good at wideout for us right now. Um, Wyatt looks good at at, at wideout right now for us. So those three, I'm counting on. Um, The ones, the ones we can be good with. So things can't happen wrong there for us. D line right now are a little bit of a question mark just because we got some kids out right now. We got to get them, get them back up and running. Uh, Caleb Wright being the main one. He's he's in the first couple in the first week, and now he's got a little bit of a a little knickknack. We got to get him back up and get his helmet on him sooner rather than later because we need him to play this year. John, John is John. Don't worry about him. Krupa looks good. Um, got some good young linebackers, you know. Um, Mitch is really good. Larkin out of Palatine, good player, strong, sudden, explosive. He's he's he can accelerate. He can move his body. He moves his body the way you want a linebacker to move. He's real sudden and strong. We just got to get him. <laughs> just got to get him to know what he's got to do. You know, I mean, these the high school kids come out playing one coverage. Well, you know, by about the third practice, we got eight in. <laughs> so <laughs> their head is their head is always going around him and Ty Weaver, but they physically they are what you want. So we feel good about those guys. And uh, the secondary, I'm happy with them right now in camp. Um, and the specialists are all back. So um, I I think right now I I worry uh, more about the defense where we're at right now than I do the offense. So. We got to make that up this week. Yeah, we got we've got some new people in the fold here. There's some that are still finishing up paperwork that aren't fully activated yet, so I'm still waiting on that. And um, but uh, we got Coach Dunn here <clears throat> from Wisconsin, uh, coaching the quarterbacks, and we got Chenzo here working with the, the running backs from Youngstown. He used to work for SpaceX. He's an interesting dude, man. Um, he's aeronautical engineering. Got his bachelor's at Ohio State. That's a pretty good school. And then he got his master's in aeronautical engineering at Purdue. That's a really good school. That's where they make astronauts. And um, and he went and worked for Musk over at SpaceX, and then he wanted to coach football. So he was, he's been at Youngstown for a couple of years, and then he came with us like about three weeks ago. 